Hi, my name is Jinx Peregrine. Welcome to the Pumpkin Patch Arcade. I hope you're doing okay. Uh, today I thought I'd uh, share some games I've been enjoying uh, the last weeks. It is autumn and it is my favorite season of the year. <laughs> so I thought I'd choose a few games to share with you that I've been playing over the last weeks. Weeks? Weeks, yes. <laughs> uh, so yeah, um, I'm new to making this kind of video, so I hope you like it. It's just going to be relatively short, like probably like 10-15 minutes maybe, uh, just going over some games I've been playing. And I thought that would be nice. There's some comfy games, uh, there's some more like autumnal games, there's um, a bit of cute, a bit of cute. <laughs> I have I have a type of game. <laughs> it's usually city builders, farming sims, and roguelikes, uh, for the most part, uh, with some magic thrown in there. Uh, so yeah, uh, I hope you enjoyed today's selection of games. If you like any of the games today, please feel free to check them out on Steam uh, or ever, wherever they may be uh, on gaming services, uh, platforms, and whatnot. And yeah. I hope you enjoy today's content and hope you have a lovely rest of your day. See you soon. Bye. strange horticulture with many requests. Some seek remedies for their health or to help them sleep. Some need the perfect gift to make a new friend. Some simply wish to scratch the ears of the store's cat, Hellebore. All are searching for something. As for me, I spend my days collecting and identifying the unusual plants of this land. Winterbore to repel insects. Pavilion to open any lock. Jacob's work to find what is lost. Daisy Dock to grant courage. Long Vericund to lift a curse. Most who visit my shop have small and simple needs. Though sometimes they can be mischievous, even sinister. There are whispers that the leader of the local witch's coven has died under mysterious circumstances. Circumstances that happen to require the expertise of a horticulturist. From hypnotic hallucinogens to powerful poisons, I can use my plants to influence the mysteries around me. For good or for ill.
is up, ordinaries. That's right, ordinaries, as in non-magic humans, which is what I thought I was until very recently. But as fate would have it, turns out I do have magic powers. Trust me, I was as surprised as you are, but it's no coincidence this change didn't happen until I ventured onto the fabled grounds of Eichenfell, school for witches and wizards. See, something sinister and strange is going on in the world of magic, and at the center of it is my sister, Safina. She's Eichenfell's most famous student, a hero, but she's mysteriously gone missing. If I'm going to find her, it is going to take wits, grit, and the right kind of friends to dive deep into the depths of Eichenfell and decode the ancient secrets that lie at the heart of the world of magic. Sound fun? Well, nobody said this was going to be easy, but if we work together, anything is possible. Right? Change. The world is all about change. And the way you handle it. We are viceroys, elite settlers serving the Scorched Queen. Our job is to establish colonies and gather precious resources. Every settlement we build is governed by its own rules. There's no single path to prosperity. Some succeed by winning people's hearts. Some by serving the crown. Others by venturing bravely into the unknown. Our decisions shape people's futures. The blueprints we choose lay the foundations of the town's economy. We adapt to changing conditions. Know what lies beyond the mist. The only thing certain is the storm. the change and build back from the storm you're a viceroy after all
Hi folks, I hope you enjoyed today's uh, indie game playthrough. It was fun for me as well. As always, I'm a big fan of games in all shapes and sizes. I mean, mainly I do like comfy, like city builders, roguelikes, farming sims, and city builders. Did I say city builders twice? <laughs> oh, I don't know. Words are hard. But yeah, I hope you enjoyed today's video as much as I did. Uh, if you have any like thoughts on the game or anything, please leave comments below. I would point, but I don't have any hands. <laughs> uh, as soon as I get hands, it's over. <laughs> um, but yeah, I hope you enjoyed today's video and hopefully see some of you again in the future. I'll be doing some Let's Plays, some more indie game demos, and maybe just sharing games that I've been enjoying recently. I really want to get into more stuff here, and I thought it'd be fun to just try out different formats of videos. And please let me know what you like as well in the comments. I'd appreciate uh, any kind of feedback as well, as long as you're nice about it. Um, so yeah, I hope you have a good day, and hopefully see you soon. Bye-bye now.